coming into what should be a leadership role. You got some, okay, some good players coming last year, but this is uh, your last two roster this week, huh? Yes, sir. And I'm really excited for this year. It's my last year, my last time, you know, step on the college field. And really looking forward to the opportunity to be a great player and also a great leader to help this team win as many games as we should. Do you have that two lane game circle from the calendar? Well, we got this, this approach is one step, one game at a time, but I'd be lying if I say, you know, I wasn't looking forward to that game. You still you still keep uh, in touch with any of those guys? Any you know, messing with each other back and forth about it this year? Yeah, I got some uh, really good friends that I met down there, you know, and we kind of joke around about the game. And, and, but, you know, at the end of the day, we just just friends. But when we get out there on the field, we're going to compete. And, you know, we, we, we expect to win here like this. How cool is it happening uh, now? I think there's four of you guys uh, with Rebel up here at, uh, on, at on, on this football team. How cool is that? It's great, you know. It, I feel like it's a lot of great players and, at, at, at West Monroe, and not just West Monroe, but other area schools in Louisiana. They, they really get unnoticed, and it's just great to see guys and see coaches that actually care not just about where they're from, but, but the place that's around them, this college and, and to go out and find those players. It, it just makes me really happy. Let's talk a little bit about you, your teammate and twice now teammate, Paul Turner. Talk a little bit about him, what he's got to bring to the table. Paul Turner, he's a, he's a great athlete. He's a hard worker. He, He's the right type of guy, you know, for for a program, and it, it really helps having him on the other side. And I'm really looking, really hoping that everything goes through for him, and really looking forward to see him make a lot of plays. Would that be pretty exciting for you to be able to start, you know, start on each side of uh, Scotty coming in and come to start of the season if that uh, whole thing kind of works out well? Yes, sir. That that would be great. I'd be really looking forward to that. Catching balls from, from Scotty. Uh, obviously through the spring and now a couple of days in the fall, I'm sure over the summer as well. What types of uh, uh, of improvements are you seeing him make you know, on a day-to-day basis? But I feel the biggest thing is just our timing, you know. Coming into the spring, it, it was a new offense. It was a lot of new guys, new coaches. And we were just trying to trying to get the basics in. But after the summer, working hard together and really going out every day and getting the chemistry, you're starting to see it unfold. And, and it's, you know, it's really exciting because we have a chance to do something great here this season. Do you feel, not just with yourself and Scotty, but with the all of the offensive guys, it's the, the relationships are really starting to form, even just off the field. Obviously, a lot of new faces. You feel like those relationships are, are coming around. Yeah, yeah, I do. Um, that's one thing about camp. You know, it gives you the opportunity to be around the teammates as much as possible, and you get to come closer, and you really get to learn a lot about people that you know that you you're around sometimes and work out during the summer. But you know, you're around them so much that you begin to pick up on little things they do, and it's you know, just a really fun experience being in camp and really learning your teammates. Talk to you a little bit. Obviously, the tempo won't be quite as, as high as it was last year. I guess just talk a little bit about how that affects you know, those guys' offense, or if y'all do just as good as you were last year. You know, in your opinion. Well, I feel like you know this, this coaching staff brings something different, and, and what we as players do, all we do is just go out and, and we believe in the plan that they have. And we're gonna go out and we're gonna play hard, and, and we believe that we're gonna win. All right, DJ.